Yeah, thanks for asking, Quinn. It's, it's been a good experience. Uh, what I really like about it is kind of the smaller atmosphere. We're able to have more extended discussions with uh, prospects, people that may be interested in Yokogawa's um, offering. And uh, really like that the sessions are uh, also being um, projected into the exhibit hall as well, uh, so that I can kind of listen in to what's going on in the main session as well. Um, and quite frankly, a lot of the, the right people that I like to talk to that are the movers and shakers in, in the hydrogen world. Yeah, the networking opportunities are uh, really great. Um, I, I would say second to none. I've had a lot of good discussions today, uh, being the first day of two and the first half of today, I would say um, the opportunities that I think are gonna be generated or make the conference worth it or the forum worth it uh, already from day one. And uh, the sessions are informative. Um, it's interesting to hear new ideas. Uh, I did, quite frankly didn't know that I would hear this many new ideas, but uh, people come from different perspectives, new technologies, uh, new processes, uh, different ways of thinking. It's, it's uh, opened my mind a little bit to uh, new activity around hydrogen, new opportunities potentially for Yokogawa as well. Have patience. I think the rules uh, are going to be clarified soon. And I would say also um, get to know people, to, to network, understand uh, all aspects, so original equipment manufacturers, uh, get to know automation uh, suppliers like Yokogawa, get to know uh, operators, owners, uh, the ones that have been doing it for the longest time, the industrial gas companies, uh, get to know them. And uh, I think uh, start there and decide what your niche is gonna be. What's the unique value that you're gonna offer to the hydrogen economy?